is coming back. Seek the Lord while he may be found. Call upon him while he is near. Do you see your streets empty? Do you see your city closed? The sin has run rampant for too long. And the cup of God's wrath has filled up. Repent for your materialism, vanity, love of money, pride, and other ungodly ways. Jesus is not pleased. Repent for the kingdom of God has come near to you. Humble yourself in his sight and he will lift you up. Do you hear the voice of God speaking to you today? We are living in the end times. The end of all things is upon us. Do you see what is going on around you? We're so scared. We're so afraid. We're hiding and huddling in our homes. Desperate to live. Afraid to die. But you care not for your soul. Why is it? It's because your fat wallets, they deceive you. Your money gets your focus on the wrong things. The sins of the flesh will lead you to destruction. We must repent for the lust of the eyes, the lust of the flesh, and the pride of life. Do you see the suffering around you? People who are broken, hurting, they need a helping hand. We see poverty all around Miami while the rich drive by in their Lamborghinis and Ferraris and Porsches, Lexus and Mercedes. We go shopping just another moment. We have a purse. We have a new phone. We have another designer outfit while people are suffering around you. Miami, now is the time to humble yourself in the sight of God so that he can lift you up. Greed will send you to hell. The Bible says it is harder for a camel to go through the eye of a needle than for a rich man to enter into the kingdom of God. And yes, we know with God all things are possible. But the love of money will eat you up, my friends. It is the root of all evil. We must repent. Seek the Lord. Jesus Christ is King. God sent His Son, Jesus Christ, to lay down His life on an altar. On a cross, he laid down his life as the perfect, unblemished sacrifice so that his blood could be shed for the atonement of your sins, to give you new life, to put a new spirit in you, to write his law upon your hearts. My friends, we can find a way for healing and restoration. Miami can be blessed once again. Miami can receive a touch from God and we can see revival in Florida. But we've got to lay aside. We got to lay aside the greed. We have to lay aside the filthiness of the sinful flesh. Stop seeking validation, affirmation, and acceptance from man, and start seeking to please God. Not just with our lips, while our heart is far from God. But we must seek to please God with the testimony of our life. God bless you, Jesus, the name above every name. That at his name every knee will bow, every tongue will confess in heaven, on earth, and under the earth that Jesus Christ is Lord. One day we will confess that he is Lord. Don't wait until it's too late. Don't wait until you stand before the throne of God. That great white throne judgment day is coming. Don't wait until your soul has been condemned. Don't wait. Do you see the end of all things upon us? Repent, Miami, now is the time. ਰੱਬ ਦੀ ਆਵਾਜ਼ ਟੀਵੀ ਦੇਖਣ ਵਾਲੇ ਸਾਰੇ ਹੀ ਭੈਣ ਭਰਾਵਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਜੈ ਮਸੀਹ ਕੀ ਅਗਰ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਸਾਡੀਆਂ ਸਾਰੀਆਂ ਇਹ ਵੀਡੀਓ ਸਭ ਤੋਂ ਪਹਿਲਾਂ ਦੇਖਣਾ ਚਾਹੁੰਦੇ ਹੋ ਤਾਂ ਸਾਡੇ ਚੈਨਲ ਨੂੰ ਸਬਸਕ੍ਰਾਈਬ ਕਰੋ ਤੇ ਬਿਲ ਆਈਕਨ ਦਾ ਬਟਨ ਦਬਾਓ ਜੈ ਮਸੀਹ ਕੀ